there's a huge data gap. And this is one of the reasons why there's not more analysis done uh, on this issue because uh, the data availability is rather poor. Um, this is because, of course, you're talking about collecting very detailed household level information in countries that are the poorest countries in the world. Uh, and often they don't have the statistical systems in place to collect this kind of data regularly. Um, however, I think it's also important to point out that it's not as bad a situation as one thinks because a lot of these countries do collect um, data at the household level for poverty mapping, you know, regular income poverty mapping. And this data can be used for analysis of the energy issue as well. Uh, it just has not been made available that easily and uh, therefore less analysis has taken place. Um, in terms of assessments, I think one of the main um, areas that requires further work is in quantification of the benefits of improved access. Um, because um, relatively speaking, there's more assessment on the cost side, on the supply side, but then looking at the impacts of access policies and improved access uh, over time in terms of productivity benefits, in terms of health benefits in terms of other types of benefits for quality of life. These have been relatively few and far between and uh, definitely need to be focused on in future research.